like these are just what you hope for as a spectator a warm welcome i'm derek ray ready to bring you match commentary and alongside me is stuart robson and the general feeling is we should be in for a spellbinding occasion it's hibernian and they face burton albion well derek when looking forward to this game you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch particularly in those central areas whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game Chapman and beating the defender Nias what's he going to do now able to close down the short well he would have been disappointed had he spilled that one Well, the referee had to stop play, and he's doing that now so the player can receive treatment. So a drop ball to restart the proceedings. Goalkeeper's ball every day of the week. Well, you can probably see why we're focusing on this fellow as one to watch. Stewart, in particular, what do you expect to see from him? Well, Derek, what a performance it was for him last time out. Those three goals were absolutely outstanding. But it was his general performance that I admired, and I'm sure we're going to see a lot more of him today. Chapman. Now, what can they do from here? And an astute piece of defending. Excellent refereeing, advantage in operation. And no nonsense defensive clearance. The attack continues, they're making considerable progress. Can't miss, surely. A goal on the back of sustained pressure. Now they deservedly hold the advantage. Well, as you can see, this is a wonderful strike. He makes the perfect connection and he has so much pace on it. It's a great goal. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Deutsch. Over the touchline for a throw in. Could cross it in here. Insufficient guile on the crossing front, you've got to say. And unable to keep possession. Well, still searching for the equaliser, but not passing it anxiously. Body on the line. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Powell has it. Chapman. Nias. And moving the ball nicely. Well, didn't go to plan in the end. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Well, when you sit off like this, you invite pressure. Plays it back. 
Oh, tremendous work from the keeper to avert the danger. Nias. Chapman. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Almost at half time, it's going the way of the visitors as things stand. Stuart, what have you made of what you've seen? Well, I think they've been the better side in this first half. They've defended well, they've looked dangerous in attack, and they've controlled the midfield. It's been. And it's come off the keeper! Behind in the game, but now they have a corner. Well, these fans have had to be patient. Could this be the equaliser? Trying to deliver it accurately. Oh, fine stop. The first half here comes to an end. The attack continues. The Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Henderson, Porteous, Henderson, Chris Cadden, strong but fair tackle. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, I really liked his first half display. He was certainly the most influential player on the field, and I'm expecting more of the same in the second 45 minutes. Crossing possibilities. Well, they've lost possession of the ball. But strong play as he keeps the ball in anticipation of support arriving. Oh, just mistimed his run and the flag going up. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Well, as you can see, the hosts have controlled the possession, but they've shown a real lack of creativity today. They need to be far more inventive in the final third if they're to turn things around here. He's protecting it effectively. Nias, what's he going to do? Well, possibilities inside the box. And the danger is still on. Nias, what's he going to do? It's in. They're looking really relaxed and confident. And not giving the opposition much of a look in. Well, here's the replay, and you can see why the manager is furious. It's just really poor play, offering up possession far too easily in a dangerous area. And at this level, if you keep doing that, you're going to get punished. It's just not good enough. So, 2-0 now. And Scott. Porteous. Henderson. At times they make passing look easy. Newell. Oh, they've lost it. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. This is a message for Adriano Negri. Happy birthday, Adriano, and have a fantastic day. A poor touch and unable to keep it in play. Throw in to come. And the substitution will occur now.
Cadden. Now, what can they do from here? Well, when you sit off like this, you invite pressure. Chance to run at them. Options in the middle. So now a corner. Time for a change then. Almost at full time, and I'll tell you what, playing away from their home patch has been a pleasant experience for them, Stuart. Well, they've been much the better side up to now. Some of their approach play has been excellent. They just need to control possession for these final few minutes to cap off a really good display. And slipped through beautifully. Well, it looked like a good ball, but cut out in the end. And able to close down the shots. Very timely interception. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. And the electronic board delivers the news. Two minutes of stoppage time. And that is that. The referee blows his whistle for full time and it's a victory for the visitors. Well, Derek, it was a comfortable win in the end. Fully deserved their victory because they dominated every aspect of the game. It was a really good result for them here today. Well, you know, when our colleagues in the newspapers come out with their grades for this match, he's going to get very high marks. Well, it's a good performance. He worked hard, played well and scored a goal. And his team won. What more could you ask for?